Well, it's bright up here. Spider, you've left me a tough gig to follow, that's for sure. Don't think I'll be as funny as you, mate. <coughs> well, um, what can I say? What an honour. Uh, when I first got the call from Rossi, I was uh, obviously really taken back um, to think that uh, I was considered to even be near the likes of some of the guys, the Bulldogs, the Harveys. Uh, it's quite amazing. But, uh, yeah, I just want to thank, thank uh, St Kilda and obviously the inductee crew for doing that. Um, to Stewie, thank you for your amazing words. Um, you are a great mate and uh, I really loved every minute we uh, played together. Um, sensational. Uh, to the fellow inductees tonight, um, Spider. Um, the beauty about all the boys that get inducted tonight being Milne, Lenny, myself and, and the legend, who I do know and I did play with, um, so we got to play with, it was just amazing. And uh, Spider, uh, you were an amazing talent, um, a great man, uh, misunderstood by some of your players, playing group, but we all loved you. Um, you, uh, I just can't believe you broke that collarbone, mate, in those final series, if only we had you there. Um, to Milne Dog, uh, just the life of the party, as in at the club, just a great man, um, amazing talent, one of the best small forwards to play the game. Um, once again, love playing with you. Um, to Lenny, Lenny, uh, sorry about the Glen Archer incident. I don't think I've ever apologised, but I was playing on Arch that day when he decked you in your first game, mate, so I do apologise. But I suppose it set the tone for you, mate. You're an amazing St Kilda man, an amazing player, um, a true leader, and once again, just loved playing every single minute with you, buddy. Sat next to you uh, week in, week out, number seven and number eight at the lockers, so it was, it was good times. Um, I suppose when you look back at your career, you, uh, now I'm sort of 10 years on now this year and I, I just can't believe 10 years has gone past and I sort of look at it and just think to myself, was it a dream? Was it really me? But I suppose uh, that's what happens, you move on and, and I haven't been, been able to function like this for a long time. So certainly is, uh, it brings it all back to you and you remember what it was like. Um, I suppose when I look back at where it all started, uh, Spider touched on it a minute ago. So did Shuey, but um, Johnny Beveridge is sitting down in front of us. Um, every one of us, all the players love Johnny. Just the greatest man uh, around. Johnny got me to St Kilda, uh, obviously, like he did many of the other boys, but Johnny was a bit cagey when he got me to St Kilda. I, like Shuey said, I was destined to, at the time for uh, Essendon, but um, Johnny somehow got the inside no off Chipper, who's here, great man Chipper as well, but um, Johnny... Uh, Johnny got me down and just, just an amazing man. Um, was a bit coyish when he got me down, didn't talk to me much. He was trying to hold his cards close to his chest. But to Johnny, um, I'm sure like all the boys who have had all the involvement with you throughout your life at the footy club, thank you. You are truly a great man, mate. So, Johnny, thank you. I'm really pumped tonight because I do actually have Danny Craven here. Danny Craven, uh, who most of you should know, uh, was a great St Kilda man. Um, Danny coached me and it was sort of when it all sort of twigged for me. Danny installed a lot of belief in me um, and uh, gave me an opportunity and obviously gave uh, uh, Johnny the inside no. So Chipper, I'm pumped you're here, mate. Congratulations. And I actually was going to tell the Tuddy story, so Stewie, you beat me to it. So there goes one of my gags for the night. So thanks for that, mate. <laughs> um, I suppose when you reflect on your career, um, you sort of think about a lot of things and I, I haven't had to think about my sort of football career for a long time. I sort of, you know, it's like I said, it feels like it was another life for someone else. But um, I mean, when I think about it, I was re originally thought I was going to be recruited as uh, maybe a dashing wingman, as you can see by the footage, Joey, which you saw before. Um, but obviously it didn't happen. I mean, I ended up at full back. I mean, who wants to play full back? I mean... You know, who wants to play there? But anyway, I must have been all right at it because that's where I stayed. Um, I look back seriously and think about uh, playing back there and I think about the honour that I got to play and all the amazing players. Um, you know, the area that I played in was just amazing and, um, you know, I just feel privileged that I got to play on some of these guys and, and obviously play with all my teammates. Um, I suppose when you do go forward and, and you look back, like I said, it's just an amazing to think what what the club means to all the boys. Um, I do feel priv privileged. Um, I got an amazing opportunity uh, to play at the club and the club certainly rewarded me with um, a lot of years. So um, I, w I just feel honoured that I got to represent my family, all my friends and um, 
obviously played for a long time at St Kilda. Um, I just want to finish off with uh, lots of thank yous um, to all the, uh, all the uh, players that I played with, all the coaches that I had an involvement with. Um, you know, they were great memories. It was so funny before, um, just out on the deck, seeing all the boys that I played with. And I think it's just awesome that all, all, so many of the guys are here um, tonight. But it was just sensational to see everyone out on the deck um, that, we, that a lot of us boys used to play with. Um, I've got groups of friends and family here. Um, thanks for coming down. Uh, thanks for coming tonight. I want to thank family that travelled uh, from Moon Estate. Uh, sensational job. Thank you very much. To my brothers and sisters, Ben, Joel, Ashley, Comrade and Olivia. Um, you've all been great supports over the years and I love you dearly. Um, to my wife's parents, Marty and Carol and their brothers and, uh, and all that. Obviously, uh, been a great support, so thank you very much. To... Um, Mama Michael, uh, been absolutely unbelievable over my life and I love you dearly. Followed me around footy, it was just great fun. Um, to Fee and Dad, um, saw me come through, drove me everywhere when I was younger, um, it was brilliant. My dad still loves the fact that he got to go on radio one time and the, and the, I think it might have been Eddie Maguire interviewed him and said, where'd your son get his athletic ability from? He said, he doesn't get it from me because when, when I think about exercising, I go and lay on the couch. <laughs> he loves that story. So that, I've got it in for you. Um, to my kids, Josh, um, going to be driving a car this year. Learners, amazing, can't believe it. 16 this year. So proud of you, Joshy. You're an amazing young man. Um, look forward to every minute we get to spend forward. Uh, to Aaron, um, Aaron, you're just an absolute little gem, buddy. Give me lots of cuddles. I love you to death. To my daughter, Aisha, beautiful little girl. Writes me beautiful notes all the time. Cuddles me and uh, just is a sensational little girl. I'm so blessed to have all three of you. And finally, to my wife, who was there pretty much from day one. I met Anya in 1997. Um, she's been a great support. She's brought up three beautiful children. Um, this night is as much about what she's done for me and for the St Kilda Football Club. And Anya, I love you dearly, and thank you very much. Cool.